Well, Mohs surgery is really appropriate for people who have a skin cancer, usually on the head and neck area. We're really concerned about being a higher risk lesion. And what does that mean? Well, usually it means one that's kind of hard to know how big it is. It might be one that has a certain growth pattern. It might have an aggressive growth pattern, or it might be in an area that's really vital, so you don't want to take too much tissue, say around the eye or the lip or the ear. And we want to make sure that we get it out first pop. We don't want to have to go back in there again. And we want to make sure that we get a cure, like 100% cure if we can possibly get that. We want to do it in the most efficient way possible. Do it once and do it properly. And if we do it by Mohs, it means we can take a little less tissue than if we did it just by looking, eyeballing, as we do with normal surgery. So with this, we're using a microscope. So we're using microscopes so that we can make the margin as narrow as possible. And what that means is we can keep the scar as small as possible. And so we end up with a good cosmetic result, but even more importantly, we get very, very high cure rates compared to routine surgery.